Have you ever pondered the aftermath of a nuclear war involving superpowers such as China, USA, or Russia? What would transpire if, amidst a moment of chaos and conflict, a button in one of these countries was pushed and nuclear missile launched? The ramifications of such an event are gigantic, and regrettably, not just a matter of fiction. In the blink of an eye, a city could be wiped out, reduced to nothing but ashes and rubble. Initial blast, depending on the size of the bomb, would incinerate everything within a certain radius. The heat from the explosion, unleashed by potential nuclear powers like the USA, China, or Russia, would be so intense that anything within its reach would be instantly. Buildings, trees, cars, and tragically people would just cease to exist. Following the immediate destruction, a firestorm would engulf the surrounding area. The intense heat from the blast would cause fires to break out, consuming everything in their path. In cities, this could lead to a domino effect, with one building igniting the next, creating an unstoppable wave of destruction. Then comes the fallout. Fallout is the radioactive particles that are propelled into the atmosphere by the explosion. These particles would be carried by the wind, potentially spreading the radioactive material over a large area. This fallout could contaminate the air, the water and the ground, making them deadly to any life that comes into contact with them. In the weeks that follow, the world would witness the horrifying effects of radiation sickness. Symptoms would start with nausea and vomiting, then progress to hair loss, bleeding, and severe burns. Without immediate medical attention, which would be scarce in such a scenario, the majority of those affected would not survive. In the months and years after the initial event, the world would have to deal with the long-term consequences. The fallout would contaminate the soil, making it impossible for plants to grow and for animals to survive. This would lead to a breakdown of the food chain, leading to widespread famine. The radiation would also have a devastating impact on the human population. Birth rates would decrease, while cases of cancer and other radiation-related illnesses would skyrocket. The world would be plunged into a nuclear winter, with the sun's rays blocked out by the dust and ash in the atmosphere, leading to a drop in global temperatures. In this grim scenario, it becomes clear that the consequences of a nuclear war are not just immediate and catastrophic, but also long-lasting and devastating. The initial blast, the firestorm, the fallout, the radiation sickness, the long-term contamination of the environment, and the nuclear winter are all stages of a timeline that we must strive to prevent. In summary, a nuclear war would not only cause immediate destruction on an unimaginable scale, but it would also have long-lasting effects that could make the Earth uninhabitable for many years to come. It would lead to an environmental disaster, with the contamination of the air, water, and soil, and a breakdown of the food chain. The human population would suffer from radiation sickness and a surge in radiation-related illnesses. And finally, a nuclear winter could plunge the world into a prolonged period of cold and darkness. So next time you hear about nuclear weapons, remember this timeline? It's a stark reminder of the power we possess and the responsibility we have to ensure it is never unleashed.